the table below shows the marks in an examination of a set of students. Calculate an estimate for the mean. So here we've got some data. So the marks have been grouped between 0 and 9, 10 and 19, 20 and 29, 30 and 39, 40 and 39, and the frequencies of these is 2, 7, 11, 12, 2. Now, if we wanted to calculate the mean, what we would do is take this value, whatever's here, and multiply it by the frequency, and then add them up. Well, we can't do this because it's actually been grouped, the data. So we have to make an estimate of the mean. So we need a value that's going to represent zero and nine, between 0 and 9. And what we do is we take the mid-interval, which is going to be 0 plus 9 divided by 2, which is 4.5. And then we do the same for the next one, which is 10 plus 19 divided by 2. And then we do the same for all the other, all the other intervals. So, looking at a new table, what we need to do is write, add two more columns to our table. One is the mid-interval, and the other is the mid-interval times the, the frequency. So the mid-intervals here are going to be 4.5, which is 0 plus 9 divided by 2, 14.5, which is 10 plus 19 divided by 2, 24.5, which is 20 plus 29 divided by 2, which is 24.5, Next one is 34.5, which is 30 plus 39 divided by 2. And then finally, 40 plus 49 divided by 2, which is 45. And then what we do is we calculate the mid-interval times the frequency. So we do 4.5 times 2, which gives me 9. 14.5 times 7, which gives me 101.5. 24.5 times 11 which gives me 269.5, and then 34.5 times 12, which gives me 414, and then finally 444.5 times 2, which gives me 89. And then what we do is we sum up the frequency, so we do 2 plus 7 plus 11 plus 12 plus 2, which gives me 34, and then we sum up this this. Uh, column, which is the mid interval times the frequency, which is 9 plus 101.5, 269.5, 414 and 89, which is going to give me 883. And then we calculate what's known as an estimate for the mean. So we have curly brackets here, curly uh, equal signs because it's an approximation. We take this number here, which is 883. Divided by 34, and then on my calculator, get 25.970. We round off to three significant figures. So that 7 will make that 9 a 10. They'll make that a 26. So the answer will be 26.0 to three significant figures. So what we've done here is we found an estimate of the mean using a frequency table.